I can't hate this game. I can't. It, it's the nostalgia factor. And the fact that it's actually a good game. Tough freaking die, people. But... I can still complain. Oh yeah, nothing. What? I get, wait, fucking... Why don't I just do the simplest tactic? Fuck you! Okay, that does not work. What the fuck is that? The abomination! I you are fucking bastard. Oh my god, that abomination when it's flattened. Ew. I'm enjoying this music right now. I love the music in this game, I'll give it that. There's nothing to complain about there. It fits the mood, and it does its job excellent. Just, mm, it's, it's pure gold. And besides the fact that the composer himself is just the fucking god. Okay, that was completely my fault. And I will accept all hate on that one. <laughs> Oops. My bad. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna get a lot of flack on that. Or at least I would if I had any viewers. Oh, that's a jab at my- oh, fuck. I should pay attention. Because I'm right back where I started. Which, I don't want to be here. <laughs> Shit. Oh, wait. Actually, this kind of works out a little bit better on my part anyways. Back to the crushing shed. Hopefully, um, the jiggies are still out here. Yay! I love that little effect. It's just like, oh, you only collected a quarter of it. Well, um, that sucks. And it only plays the little jingle part, like, part of it. It's like, watch. Now we gotta find the last piece, which is right there, by that fucking cowboy. Dun, dun, bring. I miss the yuck part though. That would've been enjoyable if they would've kept that. Like, not stopping the game for every jiggy he gets, that, cause that's just honestly annoying. Like I said, I don't like it when games just stop the flow completely. Sure, I love cutscenes and stuff, but those are meant to progress the story. Oh yeah, and this wonderful fellow. Yay! Boss battle time! Dun, 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 dun. This boss, really easy, killed me the first fucking time. Of course, Target Zan killed me the first time too. And yeah, I wasn't all that good at games when I was a kid. I'm a lot better now, and the fact of the matter is, when I'm not like doing commentary, I can actually do games really, really... I don't know, most games, if I play them on hard and stuff, I can do them really easily. Oh yeah, I should probably do this. Okay, um, except it's not switching. Yeah, here's the one wonderful part. I, it's not fucking doing that, which I love. Um, he's gonna turn up the heat and stuff. You need to kill him fast. Because, yeah, look, there's a timer. That's... I I don't know how I feel about that. Bosses that are on a timer, even though I can kill this guy really fast as it is, it's pretty much all about just peppering the bastard. But, I don't know, as a kid, when you see a timer on a boss battle, you start to freak out. I, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm not the only one that did that. Even, it's, cause, 
you're on a time limit. So, no matter what you do when you're on a time limit, you just freak out. Because now, you have an added effect onto this battle, which just automatically will kill you if you do not do it within that time. And even though the boss is actually really easy, and really doesn't have that much of a challenge to it, it's the fucking thought that you could just die because you're not fast enough. That's what gets to your head. So that's probably why I did even worse on this boss battle than I normally would have, as a kid at least. Because he killed me a couple times and it was just like, I finally put the timer part of it out of my head. And it was so much easier, because I just peppered him then. That was not my fault. I didn't even have my hand on the control stick. <laughs> woo woo woo. Yeah. But that was the boss of this level. And he also gives us, like, the one thing that's so freaking needed in this game, too. Which is another fast travel thing, but it doesn't fast travel to, like, the outer world. Or at least it does in one part. It fast travels to the freaking what is it? The other worlds. The actual levels themselves. Good choice. Um... I don't have the beak barge though, and I know that's in here, I just don't remember where. It's, um, hmm. Well, I'm sure I can find it pretty easily. Uh, until then though, we'll just go talk to Wumba. And become... The wonderful detonator. You can just hear the excitement in my voice. Is it me or her tits bigger in this game? Just saying. I'm 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 not a pig. Don't judge me. Mama call us detonated. A... I don't like this thing for the simple fact it, it it's a suicide bomber. When you do this, this is the only purpose it has in this entire level. Big whoop. It doesn't affect you. When you do it on your own, uh, a la this. Once fucking the oh the creepiest thing in this entire game that honestly should be dead right now. It disgusts me. I'm not gonna throw up. Yeah, I got chills all through my body right now, and I don't like it. <laughs> yeah, when you do this, yeah, guess what? Your main attack. Hurts you. Fuck you, Rare. <laughs> this is the entire Pichu effect. Only difference is, it doesn't kill you. It does minimal damage to you with Pichu. And honestly, I played as Pichu because he was fast as fuck. Like, he was a speedy Gonzalez. And it provided me a challenge. This, on the other hand, annoys me. Also, where are we done there? Nice. I think there's a Jinjo in here. I think. I need that anyways. Uh, if not, there's a thing in here. Oh, I hate that. I fucking I despise that. What were you thinking, Rare? I can't even attack the enemies. Like, did you? Yeah. So I'm gonna change back. I'm gonna get my health back. And I'm gonna race fucking Canary Mary in the all out 
thumb mashing war that is her goddamn races. The first race, big whoop. It's not hard at all. The second race, in click, or whatever, Cloud Cuckoo Land, I can't remember what it's actually called, called. but in this game, hmm, that lovely race was the last jiggy I ever needed to get. Thanks. And I'm sorry, fuck you rare for that race. It took me, oh wow, my bad, it took me years to actually figure out how to beat that. Not that fun! <laughs> it sure provided me a challenge, but when I don't know how to beat it, and the fact of the matter is you're not supposed to mash the button until like the very end, you're just supposed to go really slow, which no kid would actually think of doing that. You're an asshole! Oh god, I'm doing it again, breathing too hard. I'll fix that in post production. I'm not even mashing the button right now, and I'm doing this casual like. See, this part is easy. It doesn't hurt. It doesn't kill you. It doesn't ruin your childhood. It's fun. And then you get to the wonderful second race, like the official second race. Oh, it's just the fucking dandiest thing I've ever had my fingers mash. Oh. Yeah, yeah, there, buddy. Ew. Yeah, I know, even I'm just like, yeah, I, I don't really want that. Pick it up with some, like, tongs or something, dump it in the river, and wash 